Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel, Lori Candlelover. Going to do another um, Lovin' and Candle Company review this time. These are uh, post-melting, so I'm going to talk about these three candles. Um, bourbon and butterscotch, oatmeal cookies, and almond biscotti. These are one wick, 16 ounce soy candles. And you can tell most of them are, about, these three are about the same. They're just slight variations of the color, like this one's a little bit lighter kind of a white slightly creamy and then a little bit darker so fairly similar in color these ones um i really enjoyed melting these i'm enjoying getting to know lebanon candle company they definitely have some good scents and some strong ones you know i'm a bakery lover so these three uh, are totally in my wheelhouse uh, she sent these to me and i'm so glad she did because i was like bam straight out of the box i could smell these especially the bourbon and butterscotch almond biscotti oatmeal cookie probably the lightest but still such a great scent so bourbon and butterscotch we have uh this one's a really simple description which some of the hers some of theirs are they're just um some of them are more simple some of them are more detailed um not like some other candle companies where there's like 10 different ingredients in the description. There's just some of them are more simple. So bourbon and butterscotch is a strong butterscotch scent with a splash of bourbon. Now let me tell you, if you love butterscotch or anything with, you know, that type of scent, touch of bourbon, <clears throat> it is so good. And the throw on that one is probably like at least an eight, maybe eight and a half. I mean, and I don't rank them higher than eight very often unless they're like powerhouses that one is pretty darn strong and it smells so good so if you like butterscotch that one is for you um, it, it's good and then we have oatmeal cookies which is freshly baked oatmeal cookies with the aroma of ground ginger clove cinnamon and vanilla extract now I love bakery scents with spice this one um, I definitely get spices in there with those back notes of like cookie um it's not like a really strong like oatmeal raisin cookie if you know what those smell like but it's it's just good it's got a great um like oatmeal cookie type scent um with those spices coming through it really it really gives that um vibe and um i haven't had an oatmeal cookie candle before there's a lot of candles that have like cookie scents, cookie notes. This is my first oatmeal one and I like it a lot. Somebody had said on Facebook that it was one of their favorites and that she had gotten a lot of those. I can see why. Um, for me, the bourbon and butterscotch is stronger than that one melting. Um, but I definitely get the notes coming through, especially those spices. So <clears throat> that one's really nice. And then almond biscotti, which is strong aroma of freshly baked almond biscotti and rich almond sugar. Um, this one... It's probably the second strongest out of these three. And oh my goodness. Like I could, right now, even just sitting here with these lids off, I can smell these. Um, I could smell them, you know, I, when I opened the box, I could get some of the scent coming through from the candles and the wax. Like they just, you know, so far, most of them, even on cold, have a really strong cold throw. Um, but I've melted some of the wax. So I'm going to do some reviews on those two. Um, but these three are just like, she sent me the perfect combination of ones to try that are like in my scent preferences. These three are excellent. Um, I don't know if I would do the oatmeal cookies again, just because it's a lighter scent. It's not, um, it, and some people just like lighter scents. So when I say that, don't think that it's a dud cause it's not, it smells great. It's just not as strong as the other two. But if you like those kind of scents with the spice and the cookie, you'll like it and these other two once if i burn these all the way down um i would i would for sure get backups of those two just because they're stronger a little bit stronger and that those type almond and butterscotch are two of my favorite scents so i can't ever go wrong with those uh types of scents but all three of these are great i also have um eggnog and strawberry cheesecake to review plus a plus a bunch of melts so yes i'm i'm very impressed um, and I haven't burned these yet. I use my candle lamp. So, um, you know, I'm going to burn them and see how well they, they pull out and everything with a one wick. Um, people have posted on Facebook that they've burned these and 
they actually didn't tunnel. That's really good. Um, so yeah, super excited. Um, if you have any questions, please comment in the comment box and we'll see you guys again real soon. Make sure that you go to my, um, unboxing video to get, uh, codes, 20% off codes. I posted on my last, um, video and I might still put the code in the description for this one too. Anyway, thanks for watching you guys. Really appreciate your time. Please like and subscribe if you haven't already. And if you are intrigued, please check out uh, Lebanon Candle Company. So far, so good. Bye-bye.